My name is Gregory Allen White, and I'll be doing a monologue from Fabric of a Man, written by David E. Talbert. It's like this. You take an inner city black kid with baggy pants, sneakers, and a hole in his t-shirt. And you ask that young black man how he sees the world and, and his ability to create a, a positive change in not only himself, but his community and his family. Now, the response you get might not be too optimistic, but you can take that same young black man and put him in a, a custom-made suit, a crisp white shirt, and get him a fresh new haircut and a new pair of shoes, and I guarantee you that that same young black man will see himself and the world in a completely different light. Now, I'm not hating on urban hip-hop gear because there are a lot of brothers out there getting paid. But the majority of the clothes that our young brothers and sisters are buying are, are being manufactured by non-blacks who are only pimping our community for sales. And at the same time, they're creating a counterculture that believes that, that dressing down is, is keeping it real. So, while we raise a generation of young men and women who are dressing down, those in control of the financial and economic landscape are dressing up. So in essence, our young brothers and sisters are being systematically excluded from participating in the wealth of this land, all simply because of the clothes on their backs.